let's just get uh, Twitch open here. All right, so uh, I'm gonna play a little game dev tycoon today. Um, I, I feel like most people are probably familiar with the game. It's been around a while, um, and it was quite popular a couple of years ago. But uh, I, I quite enjoy it, so I figured we'd we'd give it a bit of a go. All right. There we go. Alrighty, so we're going to start at the beginning. Ooh, we have to give our company a name. And we have to have a name for a player. Let's design someone first. Let's go with that. Uh, we're gonna be re Jesus, I can't spell. rewind games, and our, <laughs> I want our name to be player. Uh, what are we gonna make our name? Like we're just gonna. Um, we're just going to be the boss. Yeah, that's it. Start. Uh, no, whatever. Just let me start. Sure, why not? Alrighty, uh, let's develop a new game. What topics do we have? Cyberpunk, evolution, martial arts, or fashion? I feel like martial arts is the right pick action game we're doing it on the PC what are we going to call it what are we going to call our martial arts game I mean let's just be basic and call it martial arts definitely has to have 2D graphics uh, I feel like we don't need a great story do need good gameplay and we need a pretty good engine. I feel like dialogue isn't very important. Level design would be and AI should be quite high. Let's go. I feel like all of these are equally important, though. Let's just go with everything being equal here. Oh, we're debugging. All right, finish the game. Let's see how this goes. Release game. While we're waiting on that, we can start developing a new game. <laughs> can I can I make a game called Evolution and call it its mystery? Yep. Uh, it's definitely an adventure game, and it's definitely on the PC. Oh, definitely 2D graphics. I feel like story has to be quite high. Oh, we got our first reviews for our, our new our first game. That's well, decent. Eight out of ten. Seven, okay. I swear to God, if you gave me a six, bastard. A six, fuck you. We're sure to gain fans quickly. Well, that's good because we have a grand total of zero currently. Okay, 4,100 units. 16 on number 16. That's not terrible. Ooh, we have 32 fans. Well, hell's bells. Uh, I 
feel like we need to put a little bit more into dialogue here. Uh, again, like I don't feel like any of these are more important than the other. So let's just go with everything being equal. 10,000 units sold? Okay, okay. We did all right with that. And it's still selling a bit. Okay. That's not so bad. Oh. I gotta leave this game. I gotta keep working on this game for a bit longer because these scores are quite low still. I bet it's not gonna let me do any more. Damn. I don't think this game's gonna go over well. But it has a great name. It's very punny. Uh, let's do some research. Let's find us a new topic. Ooh, Wild West. Wild, Wild West. I have a feeling that the... <laughs> feeling this isn't going to get good reviews. Yeah, nope. Yeah, definitely not good. Oh well, we're gonna we're gonna make a comeback, and hopefully our next game doesn't suck. Uh, cost us a few fans. Oh. Uh, let us develop a new game. Pick topic. I kind of want to do a cyberpunk. Yeah, we're doing cyberpunk, except it's gonna be cyberfunk. And it's going to be an RPG, and it's going to be on PC as well. It definitely has to be in 2D. Because I feel like the game will penalize me if I make a text-based game even at this point. Okay. Uh, oh, I feel like this should go up. Engine can go down a bit. sacrifice a bit of dialogue. I feel like world design is really important here. Sounds can take a bit of a hit. Okay, we're getting a bit more time into this. Let's squash some bugs. this game ready for release. Let's develop a new game. Oh, we need to do a fashion game. That's important. I know it's not, but it is. What's what's our fashion game going to be called? It's a terrible punny title we can use. Terrible title we can use for a fashion game. Damn, I can't come up with anything. Might have to come back to it later. Um, let's go to the Wild West. And we're going to call this Gunslinger. It's going to be on the PC because that's a good fit. Oh, Ninvento is planning on launching a home console. Oh, yeah, well, it'll never take off. I mean, oh, reviews for Cyberfunk. They have to be like 10 out of 10, right? Like, title, what? They clearly don't understand class. How is nobody giving this game a 10? It's got the best title. It's, it's clearly misunderstood. It will be beloved in generations to come. <clears throat> um, I feel like that can take a hit and we'll push up that. Uh, dialogue, and I feel like 
we can sacrifice even further for this. No, contract work. Cool. Pick up contract jobs when we need a little extra cash. Um, I feel like world design is going to be important. Graphics can go up. I feel like we can sacrifice sound a bit. Now well, let's go with it. Leveled up in a bunch of areas, that's good. A box. Let's find some contract work. Let's build a library software quickly. Oh, the test is coming out. Ah, it'll fail. Gunslinger. Clearly, again. <sighs> My god. We need to develop an engine, I think, in-house. What are we going to call our engine to? That's an important uh, decision we're going to have to make here pretty quickly. Okay, cool. Finish that. Can we research custom game engine? Yes, we can. Okay, let's start doing that then. We still have a game out selling a little bit at least, so that at least brings some money in to cover some of our costs. can now, in theory, make a custom game engine. But I feel like we need to do some more research. I want to have at least some of this stuff ready. Develop a new game. Um, I think we need a new martial arts game. I think it's going to be... Carrot Karate. Yep, that's a game. That's a game we're going to do. Or should I change those to K's? Is that better? That's better. I just want my titles to be the thing that make people not buy my games. Because, like, that's terrible. We can't support that. Uh, I feel like that's probably the right outline there. I feel like sound really isn't important here. We'll push graphics a little more. Yeah, sure, we'll do an interview. Okay, cool. Okay, we're getting some hype around this game. Cool. Uh, we could make this game. Oh, the tech's quite impressive, though. Well, we've never been that high before. We've improved our dialogue skills, which I feel like isn't important, but okay. Uh, let's do some... We can't really do any important research right now. Uh, find some con to contract work. Let's accept that. Oh, hey, look. If this doesn't get me good scores. Oh, that, okay. I mean, it's not the tens I deserve, but it's something, I guess. Let's quickly finish playtesting this whatever garbage game it is. Probably sort of like those like Ninvento guys or whatever. Bunch of losers. Um, let's uh, do we do more contract work. I don't feel like we make enough money at it though. Uh, play 
research. We have 14 research points, really. Okay, what's a... It's a terrible game we can make cheap that'll make us some money. I mean, we already made our, the greatest evolution game of all time called It's a Mystery. I don't know what else they expect from me. I'll just make a game called Evolve. It can be an adventure game be on the PC because we ain't going into that console market crap but it's gonna be text-based it'll be terrible Whoop. I feel like that we can sacrifice I'm sure we'll do like no sales on it but I kind of just need the research points more than anything I feel like that has to be quite high sacrifice level design okay go This game's got like no technology points. Um, I feel like graphics we can sacrifice for a text based game. We have put next to nothing into this game. So let's hope it makes us a modicum of profit. Because I can't imagine people are going to like it. It's not going to be good. Oh, this is actually better than I expected. I expected like twos. Oh, I'm going to get some of those too. Okay. A five? Okay. Like that's honestly probably better than it deserves. <laughs> but whatever. Um, let's do some research here. We can do mono sound. Start the research. We have that done. Um, let's see, what, what do we have for contract work we can do quickly? Oh, let's just debug this program, make a little extra cash. I don't know if we get any research points while doing this. I don't think we do. Oh, we do. Okay, well, that's good. It's not enough to do anything. Let's see if we can get any more contract work. Accept that. Master, I need one more research point, you bastards. I needed one more, guys. Come on. Contract work. Four. Uh, do I risk it? No. We are going to. Generate game report. I'm going to go back in the archives here. What did well for us? Um, average score was a 7. This <laughs> had 3.25, 6.5, 5.2, 6.5. Look, we haven't had a lot of good reviews. But technically, martial arts was our best. Carrot Karate wasn't far behind, so I feel like we do another martial arts game. Uh, what can it be, though? Let's just call it Judo, because that sounds like a game that would have come out on the NES. It could be an action game, but we're not putting it on no console. We're staying on the PC. It's going to have at least 2D graphics. We're not, we're not going to completely cheap out on this game. So down there, up that, let's go. Uh, dialogue is not going to be important in a game like this, but level design, I feel like, and AI will be. Uh, 
graphics will be important. I feel like sound can go down, and I feel like, oh, let's leave world design pretty high. Okay, this game's got a lot of bugs right now, which might help us get some more, push a few things up a little bit. Okay, that might not be terrible. This might do okay. <sighs> Reviews for our game. Oh, looks like we're going to do okay. Seven. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'd love to see an eight somewhere. I'd love to see an eight. Okay, seven. That's fine, but I'd love to see an eight here. Okay, not terrible. But I think that means we can research game tutorials, start, get that done, and then we're going to build our first engine. What are we going to call our engine? That seems like an important thing to come up with. I kind of want to name all of our engines off of wrestling games, because I think that might be kind of fun. So yeah, we're told, I think we're going to call this one No Mercy. I feel like that's what we got to do. Um, develop new game engine. Oh no, that's new game. To create custom engine, there we go. We want that, we want that, we want that, we want everything. We can barely afford to do this but it's going to be called No Mercy. Look, it's going to cost us a lot of money, but I feel like it's going to be worth it. We could get a little research points out of here. That would be really helpful right about now. that's going to enter the market. More of that console nonsense. It'll never take off. I think we need... We, okay, good. We'll have enough research points we can get a new, like, genre. I kind of want to have that to launch the new engine with, like, a new game type. Uh, ooh. Mad Science, Detective Mystery, but we already have Evolution, and that was a mystery. Hmm. Detective? Yeah. Start research. We're going to have a detective game. And it's going to be Police Squad. <laughs> Develop a new game. Police Squad. Pick a topic. Obviously, it's a detective game. <laughs> Why isn't parody in here? It's going to be, I feel like, an RPG. It'll be on a PC, and it'll run on the No Mercy engine. Oh yeah, we're going with the better graphics, absolutely. We're not cheaping out on this game. Oh, it needs a linear story, it needs a save game, and it needs a tutorial. Go up there. I feel like all of these are important. I feel like maybe engine could go down a bit. Oh god, we're almost bankrupt. We've only got like 26 grand left. Dialogue is going to be important. Level design can sacrifice here. Uh, we're going to go up to mono sounds. Uh, I feel like that's about right. Okay. This game's looking like it's going to be a pretty big improvement. a few bugs here because we're like bankrupt <laughs> we have like no money 
So let's get this game out the door, make some money. Game's out, let's find some contract work because we need to pay some bills. Um, take it. I need the 14 grand. Oh, police squad. I better see 10 out of 10s, otherwise I know you didn't play it. Oh, nine? I'm liking that. I'm liking that. What? A seven? Oh, you, you just don't get it. A six? A seven? What? These people clearly don't understand police squad. Oh, but it's selling very well. I'm happy with that. Uh, let's do some research. Let's find a new topic. Oh, we're definitely doing a movie game. What are you talking about? I've got many terrible ideas for that. Oh, yes. We've successfully developed movies. Develop a new game. We have to do a movie game. <laughs> I'm not going to go with my first thought. and Because um, it's... Nope. <laughs> Be on the... Oh, God. <clears throat> we are not going to call the game that. Um, what are we going to call our movie game? Call it to I should call it development hell. Um, what's a movie game we can do? Uh, let's call it. Let's just do movie. Movie. No. Um, what's a terrible idea? Other than my first terrible idea, which I won't do. Um, that's a terrible idea for a movie title. Like a game. Uh, God damn it, I can't come up with anything. Um, writer's Block. Oh, that's an actual award. That's fantastic. <laughs> I did not know that was an achievement. Um, Um, can it be associate producer? Oh, I can call my game associate producer. I'm absolutely doing that. I don't know what this game is and how it's an action game, but it damn well is. Um, yeah, that's fine. I know every little kid's going to want to play associate producer. Hey, the PC market is growing. Uh, I feel like artificial intelligence can go down. Uh, I feel like sounds aren't very important. Yeah, I feel like that's probably fine. I'd love this game to be really good so we can raise some capital and maybe get like a nicer office that isn't a garage although I do like our little DeLorean here I'm assuming that's what it's meant to be this might not be terrible oh. of course it's underpowered compared to a PC PC Master Race and all that right Uh, let us design casual games. I mean, the filthy casuals need something, I guess. <laughs> Reviews for associate producer came in. I mean, yeah, fair enough. I wanted one review to just give it a 10 out of 10, because that would have been funny. <sighs> okay. I should have called it Best Boy. Damn it. Why didn't I think of that at the time? Oh, well. Um, 
we need to develop a new game. What topic are we going to do? I feel like Detective did well for us last time, so maybe we'll do another Detective. Or Casual Detective game, maybe. <gasps> no, we're going to do the fashion game, because that at Casual will probably do really well. And if we put it on... Oh, the licensing cost is prohibitively expensive. I gotta take a risk on it. Um, what are we gonna... It's gonna be on the No Mercy. What are we gonna call it? What's a good name for a fashion game? Um... Absolutely gonna call it fashionista. I did not have have to Google how to spell that. I knew off the top of my head. I promise. Three D graphics. Uh, okay, we can only go minus fifty k. That's not good. I need more money than that for this brilliance. Oh, it doesn't need a story. No, we can cut that. No, no, this isn't important. That's really what matters. Oh, we're into positives again. Okay, good. Uh, artificial intelligence. I feel like dialogues aren't very important. This would have been perfect for the game wing. Oh, well. It should do well on the... Totally not NES. I feel like world design isn't important that much. This might actually get decent reviews, like enough that I can... Oh, okay, we're absolutely going into research here. Oh, I don't have the money to do stuff. Hopefully that changes when this hits the stands. Yeah, I don't care, but it'll sell well, because it's for casuals. And a 6 out of 10 probably won't care. Okay, uh, contract work. Um, let's take this play test. There, boom, we made some money. Uh, I wouldn't mind finding a little more contract work. Let's take another contract work. Quick contract job, make a little cash a couple of research points. Let's research open world. I feel like that's important. Whew, okay, we're getting somewhere. Okay, we've finished the research. Let us, let's, ooh, uh, that's 18.3 weeks. I think we can do it. Oh, it's gonna be damn close. Oh, we've made it just in time. Okay, uh, let us do a little more research here. New topic. Oh, expedition? Mad science. Oh, we have to go with mad science. What's our mad science game going to be? What's our terrible mad science game going to be called? Because I'm not going to try to lie to people and say that we're going to make good games. We're going we're gonna to make casual games. Uh, no, I can't do it on there. I can do it on there, though. Uh, no mercy. 
uh, and it's going to be called. Uh, I always have such a hard time coming up with dumb titles for these games. Um, Doctor Ludwig's Lab. I don't know why that came to mind, but it did. Uh, it should have a story and tutorials, and I feel like story's a little bit important here. Uh, artificial intelligence should be high. I can drop that a bit and maybe up dialogue a little. I feel like that's fair. That could go up. Yeah, let's go with that. Oh, leveled up on story and quests. High contract. Oh, no contract currently available. What can we research? Level editor? Okay, do it. Oh, they really hated this game. Like, really hated it, apparently. Oh my god. Hopefully stupid people buy it. That's our target market, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> the uninformed and the ignorant. Oh, that's a drop-off between one week to week. God damn it, I was trying to take advantage of stupid people and it backfired. Um, yeah, any contract work we can take. We need a little, a little extra cash here. We're only going to shift like maybe 12,000 units of that game. Not great. Not great. Let's do a little more contract work. What else do we have? Oh, we'll take that. I need. What's going to be our big hit game? I feel like our next. We need to put out another, uh, I need to create another engine, I feel like, but I also don't have the money to do it. Uh, develop a new game. I'm going to pick a topic. What are we going to do? Oh, we're going to make Best Boy. <laughs> um, I feel like we should focus on making this a simulation <laughs> on the PC, and it's going to run on the No Mercy engine. We're going to downgrade the graphics, though. Okay, that doesn't matter. I never developed for it anyway. Uh, we can drop the story down. Best Boy doesn't need a good story. Uh, I feel like none of this is really important. I don't think artificial intelligence is important for this game. Yeah, sound isn't very important. I feel like world design isn't really terribly important either. Ooh, we pushed design over 20, or 220, now over 20. Okay, we might actually do okay with this. <laughs> I'm gonna laugh if this is the game that like makes us a stupid amount of money. Uh, let's play test this game while we're waiting for reviews. Oh, we got a pr proposition. Oh, this is that whole hacker deal that comes up. Decline. But 
reviews for Best Boy came in. Oh my god, am I going to get a 10 out of 10? Oh my god. We're actually getting good reviews for this stupid game. <laughs> That's too perfect. Don't give me a 10 out of 10, please. Oh my god. <laughs> terrible ideas I've had, that's the one that's going to make us stupid amounts of money. Oh, that is... That is so good. <laughs> it's so good because it is so terrible. Okay, let's do a little research while that game's out selling like a mother. Absolutely, we're moving to an office suite. We have terrible games and we're going to make more of them. Oh, I can hire staff now. Perfect. I need to hire some staff. Now I have to do the training thing. Uh, train staff management. Do the training. What's our next dumb game going to be? Can I just start making knockoff games? Um, I wanna I don't wanna spend a lot of money recruiting. Let's go hundred grand. And I want a game demo from you. Start looking. Um what's gonna be our terrible next game? Okay. You're gonna want twenty three thousand a month. You're more of a tech person, okay? You're way more of a tech person and you're cheaper. And you're more of a design person, but you're both the same. I'm going with you. Hire someone famous. Well, okay, well. Uh, train. Welcome training. Do what you gotta do. In the meantime, I am gonna do some research here. Uh, better dialogues. Can we make a Doom knockoff called Mood? And by can we, I think that's what we're doing next. I'm totally doing this. I'm a terrible person. Oh, we don't really have a topic for it, though. Damn it. How am I supposed to make terrible games if you won't let me have the genres I need? Debug pro Let's debug this program. Come on, buddy, help me out here. We gotta debug this friggin' program quickly. Oh, we just made that in time. Uh, let's develop a new terrible game. Um, oh. Um, Wild West. We're gonna do a Wild West, Wild West game. It's gonna be casual. Uh, it's gonna be on the gameling. Yeah, we'll acquire a license for it. It'll be on the No Mercy engine, and it's going to be called... <laughs> what terrible thing can we call it? Um... Oh, what terrible name can I come up with for a Wild West game? Um... No, that's more for a farming game later. Um, farming fighting game. Um, what's it going to be called? I'm going to call it Dust Bowl. Let's go. Let's spend a little bit more on this game because it's terrible. Yeah, let's keep that. Uh, buddy, you could help. Thanks. Um, well, yeah, that seems fine. That's nice. I'm going to just put out this terrible game instead. I don't really care about sounds, but up the world design. I 
it's terrible that this is the game with the best tech I think that we've released. I think. Uh, yep, it is. Release the game. Um, create custom engine. Okay, what's this game going to be called? Um, well, obviously it's going to be Attitude. No, 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 it's not. Back stage. Assault. Yeah, there we go. Because <laughs> it has open world. I'm a terrible person. But I'm okay with that. Dust Bowl reviews came in. How terrible. It's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Okay. We might actually do okay on this. This might not be terrible. Buddy, you could help me uh, kind of make this game here. That'd be great. Or this, this engine, sorry. <laughs> Our backstage assault engine. <laughs> ah. This makes me so happy. Well, apparently now I'm not doing my part. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Backstage assault engine is ready. Oh, I have to write, I have to research new topic. What new topic are we going to do? Hospital. Oh, well, yeah, of course we're doing a hospital game. What are you going to research? You can research a new topic as well. Oh, and space? Oh, my mystery? Okay, well, I mean, it's obvious what we have to do. Completed hospital. And you've completed mystery. And now we're going to develop a new game on our new engine. Backstage Assault. Uh, I feel like we're going to put it on... Uh, game Link. Cause I, no, actually I want this one on PC. I want mystery, and I want it to be an adventure RPG, RPG, and it's going to be, oh god, I can't even spell, evolution, because it's a mystery, do I only have 2D graphics on this. Damn, okay, well, whatever. Better user experience, though. Stories has to go up, gameplay can come down, engine can come down. Oh. Uh, level editor and better dialogues. Uh, yeah, that seems fine. want this game to do stupid well as well just because it would make me happy uh yeah that uh let's put a little bit more to sound there we go so this from a technical and design standpoint will be the best game we've ever released can we like do a little like publicity here like can we no i don't want to fire him I want to do publicity for the game. <laughs> Our stupid joke game is the best thing we've ever released. Oh, that makes me happy. <laughs> I swear to God, if this gets 10 out of 10 from somewhere. God, it's getting like sevens and eights. That's fantastic. Oh my god, I got a nine. <laughs> oh, how many more terrible ideas can I come up with today? 
contract work. What can we pick up that's easy? That should be pretty easy. Only two of us. here quickly. I feel like I'm going to research marketing and you're going to research nothing apparently. Okay. Well, we can train you for something then at least. Let's do that. Only while the game's in development, okay. I'm gonna wait for this guy to finish his training, and then we'll start. And then we'll start our, our nonsense next game. How much longer do you need to do the, oh, there we go. All right, what's our next stupid game gonna be? We have 1.6 million, but no research points. Let's develop a new game. What's the topic going to be? Hospital. We're going to make a game called Hospital No. Happy Hospital. Happy Hospital. It's not even a but I feel like, again, casual game, put on the game wing, <laughs> backstage assault engine, and let's hope that somebody's dumb enough to buy it. Story can go down, gameplay should be higher, and engine should be a bit higher. After this, I should probably send Homeboy on a vacation. I don't want to burn him out. Let's see what we can come up with for, uh... Ooh, the successor to the TAS. I mean, it's still a console, so obviously, I mean, yeah. Uh, let's go with this. I say this as we make a game for the <laughs> portable. demand we patch the game okay well let me finish the game I'm on currently and then we'll patch it how does that sound develop a patch yeah, I don't care we'll patch the game you can go on a vacation send on a vacation I'll try not to destroy the company while you're away I mean, it's my company Oh, this isn't going to go over well. Good God. Am I going to get a 1? Oh, okay. I thought I was going to get a 1 out of 10 there. Well, I might have destroyed the company. Um, okay. Uh, we're going to wait for dude to get back. Okay. You're back. Let's research some new topics, maybe. Uh, oh, a vocabulary game. Yes, let's do that. Research. A new medium games. Let's do that as well. I feel like if we release like an educational game on PC, that could go over well. Yeah, but they won't want to make the stupid games I want to know that I or that I want to make. <laughs> That's the problem. I'm not finding a publishing deal. This is going to be a small game. It's going to have the topic of vocabulary, and it's going to be called Word Warrior, and we're going to sell it to schools and shit. That's where you make all the godforsaken money. PC. Backstage assault. 
let's do it. It's gonna be one of those terrible games that you could order on the those you know the catalog you used to get in school. That might be just a Canada thing. You could order books and crap, and they had like educational PC games in it. That's the market we're going for right now. Uh, I feel like dialogue should be important for this, so we can minimize the others. And if we're allegedly trying to teach children a, a vocabulary, we should probably have a you know good words. Well, let's up that. I feel like the rest of this probably isn't terribly important, but whatever. Holy crap, there's a lot of bugs for us to fix, thanks. Well, so we hit a new record for design. Let's release the game. Simulation games recently. Find a publishing deal. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I want to see what they want me to make, though, because if it's not something I'm going to enjoy, law, casual, any topic, RPG, but I only have to have a minimum score of five. Okay. Oh, yeah, no, you want that's wait, no. I'll accept this deal, because they just want me to make an RPG. Oh, can I make Cyberfunk too? Terry's back. <laughs> okay. on the PC, it's the backstage assault engine. Yep, yeah, okay. Yeah. Word Warrior came in. Oh, they're abysmal. <laughs> oh, that's not good. We need to develop a new engine after this. Uh, oh, shit. We're not going to be at a 5 out of 10, are we? <laughs> Oh god. Um uh, de boss. Gotta do the dis uh I feel like we need to up story. Uh you're more of a tech guy. I feel like game engine is tech, definitely. De boss needs to work on the story. And de boss needs to do gameplay. Maybe we we should hire someone quickly. Let's not spend a lot of money. Show me a game demo. Oh, I don't care about this stupid console. Okay. Uh, she's not very experienced, but she's cheap. Paul Zimmerman, he's not very expensive, he's also cheap. Research is higher on him, but she's faster. I'm going to take her. You. Train. Staff welcoming. Do what you gotta do. Uh, I feel like dialogues aren't that important, but level design and AI should be a bit more. Um, you're more of a design person, so we'll put you on world design. I'm going to write the dialogue. Homeboy here is going to work on the AI. Obviously, it's, it's this game better get good reviews. We're fucked if it doesn't. <laughs> to destroy your company. <laughs> uh, I feel like sound should get a bit higher. What are you going to work on? You can do graphics, you can do sound, and you can do world design, I guess. Alright, let's see what happens. 
What's this? Medium sized contracts have been unlocked. This is not a good sign. Our This is not good. <laughs> Shit, it's not even gonna get a five out of ten. Oh, we're bankrupt, I think. I don't think I have the option to really trash it. Um, let's maybe create a new custom engine. Do we have enough? We haven't to come up with anything else. Cyberpunk 2, Terry's back. Okay. Uh, woo. Oh, that's real bad. Our publisher is not going to be happy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We actually still are doing, like, it's selling not terribly, so it wasn't all bad. Um, simple cutscenes, let's do that. Have you research? What can you research quickly? Uh, day and night cycle. And you will do a little training thing with. <sighs> Simple cutscenes, day and night cycle. She's still working on whatever. Uh, publishing deal. What other. Minimum score five. We're not going to hit that. We need to develop a new, um, a new engine. Create a custom engine. Create custom engine. What are we going to call it? Uh, we can add simple cutscenes. We can add a day and night cycle. It's going to be called. Nitro. That's not actually a terrible name for an engine either. Like that sounds like something that could actually happen in the real world, other than on like backstage assault. <sighs> Although, I, if any company is listening, call your engine backstage assault. That would make me endlessly happy. I will buy your game if you do that. Guaranteed, don't even care what it is. Let's take a quick contract job just to, you know, make a little money. Because uh, we need a little extra cash right now. Because we just spent a whole lot of money on that engine. Okay. Let's develop a new game. We're gonna go for a medium game. Ooh. Uh, we best find a publishing deal. Because we need it. Minimum score four. Accept contract. <laughs> Done. Uh, let's make a. Th oh, it has to be a medium game. And it has to be casual. Okay. Be on the game link. It will be a. Vocabulary? No. I think it should be martial arts. We're going to make a kickboxing game. That's what the kids like, right? It's going to be on our Nitro engine. First time anybody's seen it. Jesus. I mean, I have to take it on this route of business. Yeah, I mean, I guess we'll go with this. We just need to get this game out, and hopefully it doesn't completely suck. <sighs> Good God. I might bankrupt the company with my stupidity. I'm okay with that. Level design, artificial intelligence. Yeah, let's go with this.
Uh, let's add a day and night cycle. Sure. What could be? What could go wrong? Okay, we've got a bunch of bugs to squash here, so let's let's get on that. Ooh, I don't know if we um, if this game's gonna do very well. Let's take a quick contract job because I have a funny feeling we're gonna need the cash. Oh god. Oh, it's bad. Oh god. How? Like, it's a brand new engine. How is it getting such terrible reviews? <laughs> so we're definitely going under. Um, contract work. Um, nope. Let's do that. <laughs> we need cash. Okay, let's develop a new game. Maybe, maybe we should do some more research and do another engine. Uh, 3D graphics. Oh, but we don't have any money. Uh, you're going on a vacation, and you're going to basically have to do a contract by yourself. Eight weeks, this shouldn't be a problem. Come on. Let's let's go. Um we need to finish this contract quick. Cuz if we lose this contract, we're foobar. Uh a <laughs> small booth. We can't afford anything else. Uh, we should start developing a new game. Uh, um, make a detective game. We'll make it the casual market. We'll put it on PC. We'll put it on the Nitro engine. We're going to call it... Uh, defective Detective. Mm, yeah, I probably shouldn't cheap out on that. I feel like story should be high, but gameplay and engine can take hits. Yeah, those are all probably important to have. Uh, uh, yeah, okay, do it. Uh, dialogue's probably important. Level design, I feel like, probably isn't. I don't think we need a level editor in this game. I'll save that five grand. Because we desperately need it right now. Oh, we're, I'm, games, games, games. What more could you ask for? Oh, we're getting a decent amount of foot traffic. 42,000 people? Okay, okay, okay. That's not terrible. Uh, this all seems fine. This all seems fine. Um, let's do a little marketing here. Uh, let's just do... Oh, I can't even do that. Okay. Okay, yep, I'll agree, because again, 
We're out of business if I don't. Defective, detec defective detectives on the market, though. That'll save us. Um, let's do some research. Uh, character profession. Oh my god, why is it getting such terrible reviews? I mean, I know it's a dumb name, but that shouldn't affect anything. do multiplayer and you're going to take a vacation oh god oh good god okay we need a publishing deal because I need some upfront cash uh, this isn't good. I need to develop a game quick. Uh, movie. No, we're not movies. We're gonna do... Mystery. Haunting of Hill Manor. Uh, this should be casual should be on here and it's going to use the nitro engine we're going to downgrade the graphics though oh crap we're out of business <laughs> we do not have enough money to finish this game we are bankrupt <laughs> damn it we're making good stupid games Well, I guess that's where we cut the stream today. That was fun. Maybe we'll come back and uh, do this a little bit more next time. All right, until next time, bye.